Ich liebe diesen Ort, I love this place. I can always relax here. And I've spent many happy hours here with friends and my girlfriend. 30-year-old Daniel Brekalo is an artist. He started out applying graffiti to disused railway lines and walls. And even today, he likes to work with public spaces. Born in Bosnia, he now lives and works in Essen. The history of graffiti is closely tied to the Ruhr region. I wouldn't say I was proud, but I'm definitely very glad to have been part of that history. And that's something my work expresses. He works with paintbrushes, paint rollers and paint. He works on canvases, paper and of course walls. These days, everyone associates graffiti with spray cans, thanks to the American hip-hop culture that reached Europe in the 1980s. But in fact, long before that, graffiti artists worked with paint, and many still do. Painting gives me so much scope, it allows you to actually feel the wall far more than you do when you work with a spray can and never actually touch a surface. There's nothing illegal about Daniel Brecalo's work these days. He's involved in projects with young people and also accepts commissions. He makes a living as an artist and his work can be seen all over Essen. So long as you know where to look. This place was empty for several years and gradually it filled up with little paintings. There was always someone with me who just enjoyed the atmosphere, sitting around the ruins with a glass of wine. There used to be a lot of crates here so people could just sit around. Daniel's father, Ivan Brekalo, came to Germany at the end of the 1960s and worked on construction sites. He was later joined by his wife, and brothers. Ivan's youngest brother, Peter Brekalo, became an independent contractor in Germany in the 1980s. He still lives in Essen. I love the people here. I love the way the people here live and work. This is my world. I glaube, das ist mein 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 Welt. As a teenager, Daniel Brekalo also worked for his uncle. I was still really young, 16 or 17, and performed simple jobs like sweeping up or hauling things. I have a lot of respect for guys who do that, because day after day, especially in construction work, it's pretty hard. The artist quickly realized that the construction business wasn't for him. He preferred to use the walls his uncle built as canvases. But even an old coal briquet works in a pinch, provided he can cover it with graffiti. So for Daniel Brekalo, this year's European capital of culture has much to offer. Some people go for a walk or to an art gallery. Because I can read graffiti, and recognize the treasures along suburban railways, especially here in the Ruhr Valley. I take the train and look at the art. His works are visible from the train line too. For Daniel Brekalo, there's no better place to admire and create graffiti than the Ruhr Valley.